business owner is outraged tonight after his barber shop was vandalized by two UD students. He's not only mad about the damage and what he has to deal with, but he also says UD police didn't take immediate action. Arnett Taylor spoke to the owner, and we also talked with the university officials. Jerry Eli says when he came to work this morning, he noticed something unusual. What's supposed to be a barbershop pole right here disappeared last night, and he says two UD students are responsible. The incident happened at Jeff and Gary's barbershop on Irving. The students were actually there this morning when Eli arrived for work. They admitted to what they had done. He says the students claimed they had been drinking and things got out of hand. Shortly after, UD police showed up to his business with the barber pole that was stolen. But Eli says police didn't initially take a report. That's what he called us. A report has since been taken. I don't have thousands of dollars just to go out and, you know, repair something that a student wants to come down here because he don't, because he's, you know, in whatever mood he's in and, and damage our property. Now, there is some good news that's come out of all of this. The two students who damaged this building said that they promised to pay all the repair costs and we checked. And those costs can range from anywhere between $800 and $4,000. Reporting in Dayton, Annette Pedler, ABC 22 News. And, of course, we reached out to UD University officials releasing this statement saying the property was returned and the individuals will be held accountable through the student conduct system. We are contacting the owner of the building to determine if he wishes to pursue criminal charges.